Mr. Salman be here <laughs> and Terry. So <clears throat> it is a proud moment for each one of us, especially those who have come from Nepal, who have the Nepalese heritage, to our, our best friends in Texas State House have done something for us, which is, uh, we are very grateful to that, declaring February 16th as the Nepal Day, Nepali Divas in Texas, February 16th. <laughs> Congratulations to each one of you. Saying this, we have some of our organization and Organized members from that organizations, they worked uh, tirelessly to get what we are here today. But now we, the next speaker I'm going to call upon is somebody where this Dhaka Topi looks so good. <laughs> <laughs> and Salman said that he's going to visit Nepal for uh, uh, climbing the base camp of Mount Everest. I would request him not to put this topi there because all the movie directors will come and ask him to join them. <laughs> so saying this, a true friend of our community, a good friend of mine, Mr. Salman Bojani. Also, Sabelari uh, Namaskar. I'm so honored to be here. That's what I learned. I think Dinesh need to teach me more Nepali so I can learn more about that as well. I'm really honored to be your state representative and to represent you in the state house. Um, thank you all for coming today. It is such an honor when I was inviting or when I was recognizing the Nepali community on the house floor. This has been never done before, right? Such an amazing opportunity for the Nepali community. And my hope will be that this becomes a tradition where we come to the state capital every single a year, every other year. So just so everybody knows here that the state house is in session not every year. It's every other year. So, and the date may change, just so you know, right? It may be February 16th this year. And two years from now, it has to be done on a Tuesday or a Wednesday. So whatever that Tuesday or Wednesday in February is, let's make a tradition of having all the Nepali communities from all over the state of Texas. I'm, I'm glad that somebody from Lubbock is here, but there's so many small, small cities in the state of Texas. Where I'm sure, I guarantee you there are Nepali community members there. Uh, I actually, when I came to America, I worked at gas stations. And some of you know in the North Texas area, there's so many Nepali community members that work in the gas station. In fact, one of my first partners uh, in gas station was a Nepali. His name was Utsav Kadiwara. And I know I've met some people that have that same last name. And so, you know, you guys are really contributing to the business and to the economy for the state of Texas. And you guys need to get the credit for that, right? Because we're really good about making money and, and progressing up in the American dream ladder, but we're not good about letting people know what a great community we have. How much do we come together? We respect our elders. That's something that I think the mainstream community needs to learn from us. How do we continue to respect our elders and take care of our kids as well? So next time I hope, I'm glad that I see a lot of women here because that's one thing that I, I felt like we need to you know, magnify and uplift our women especially because one common theme that um, normal some Americans tell us that, oh, we don't uplift our women as much. And so let's do that. And also youth, if we can also bring youth. Next time, I really want to see maybe 50 youth members. Let's, let's do that. Let's go out to our schools and see how we can bring youth because they are our future. And if we don't train them how to do it, it's first time for a lot of us, right? Hopefully, it's not going to be the first time for them because they've been here every single year. That's what we need to make sure. But as a state representative, my job is to, again, uplift the voices of the communities of 1892. And ULIS has a lot, a lot of Nepali community members. And it's one of the biggest community members. And I'm so glad that we have a city council member right now in the city of ULIS that is from Nepal, right? He's Nepalese uh, council member Tika Dai, Tika Podel, if I call him Tika Dai. But uh, Tika Podel, right? So, and, and please pray for his father. He, he just lost his father. So my heart goes out to him and, and you know, just uh, condolences to him as well. I'm so excited again to welcome you here and you know the diversity that we have in the Nepali community is what makes us really strong and I hope that we can have we can showcase that diversity in so many different ways we are all united in our pursuit of progress prosperity and we can, must continue to work together to build a brighter future for every single Texan including the Nepali community 
please know that my office door is going to be always open. I welcome your thoughts, your ideas. Um, if you have anything that you, so one of the things that we're working on is having a religious holiday, state holiday for the community. So I have other holidays and Diwali is going to be also a state holiday. So I'm going to try to get more support from that. This is just a bill that I filed. And hopefully let your, let your state representatives, wherever they are, and the senators know that we need to work on that. Um, and together we can make this a better place for everybody. Uh, but my door is open. I just want to give a quick shout out to my team that's here. I've got my uh, chief of staff, Brianna Minard. You want to stand, please? So she's my chief of staff. Um, so, you know, she's the one that makes the whole office run uh, smoothly for me. And so please reach out to her if you need any kind of support. And then I want to give a big shout out to our Mason, uh, Mason Reed, our communication director, and just a phenomenal individual. You know, he, he does a lot. So anything to do with their communications, you know, you can reach out to him as well. And then I can't forget the love of my life. It's, it's just Valentine's Day yesterday, right? Uh, Dima, please, please stand and be recognized. Yeah, she's been by my side all the way. So remember I told you I came to America when I was uh, working at gas stations, mopping floors for six bucks an hour. She and I met at that time. So I don't know what she saw in me that I didn't see in myself. But since then, she's been saying, you know, do you want to do something more? Do you want to do something more? And she lit that fire under me so much that I've been so successful in this, in this, in business, so successful in politics, but all credit goes to her. So thank you so much, Ina, for being there for me. And lastly, I just want to say, you know, like as Dinesh Dai said, I'm going to, I'm going to uh, Nepal, Kathmandu. Uh, I land in, I think, September 15th or something to climb the, the tallest mountain base camp, Everest. And so please pray for me <laughs> because my friends, there, there are 10 of us going. All my friends have already started to work out. Guess what I'm doing? I'm not working out because I'm working here, right? And so I start in June on my workout, two or three hours every single day to climb that. We're going to be going like every day, 10 hours when we go to, the, uh, to Kathmandu to go climb this. It's a 16 day expedition. So I want to try to come back. My wife has asked me to come back in one piece. And so please, you know, pray for me as I come back and I'll report back to y'all what my findings were. This is the first time I'm going. I've never been to Nepal. So if y'all have any like people that I should meet in Nepal, I really want to meet because the people are the best part of the community. Right? They are the ones that add to the cultural diversity that we have. And so any, I probably have one and a half day in, in Kathmandu before we go on our expedition, but would love to meet anybody. If you have any parents that I should go visit and all that, uh, that that's what I want to do. Thank you so much again. Thank you. So uh, good luck Salman for... Oh. So... Salman is getting younger and a big happy birthday to Salman. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to Salman. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> we will, uh, for the cake, please knock Salman's house, okay? <laughs> <laughs> so, uh,